Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be looking at a hair product which is slightly different. So if you were to watch my channel, I have recently had, well I say recently, how time flies, I suppose it's been about a month now since I've been back, um, and I went to the stunning island of Sikinthos in Greece. Had a really, really amazing time, absolutely lovely, I would go back there in an absolute flash. Um, but what I want to look at today, as you've probably known from my channel, I like to look at all different hair products, uh, sort of keeping the condition in your hair, sort of making your hair thicker, helping your hair grow, and then of course those styling products for those nice sleek hairstyles. Today is a product brand which I seen whilst I was in Sikinthos, and I was just looking around as you do in those really lovely shops whilst you're on holiday, and I came across a range or an aisle in a really, really lovely shop in Kalamaki and they had all different products and I came across a hair brand. So this is what we're going to be looking at today. So the product range is called Aphrodite and it really really came across as a really luxury product and actually I did think that I was going to gift this to somebody but it actually it turned out that it ended up staying in our family home. So for example I have used this, my brother has used this, my mum has used this. Bearing in mind I have sort of like hair towards uh, mid bridge my nose, my brother has slightly sort of wavy hair and my mum has really really long hair. Um, so the brand which we're going to be looking at is this one here. So it's the shampoo and conditioner. So as you can see really really sort of Mediterranean look sort of packaging you can see the olives there on the front of the bottle yes being it was grease it does contain olive oil but I thought that would be a really really lovely product to try overall yes really really pleased really really nice product to use let's just jump straight in with it so the Aphrodite shampoo this one here is the secret of natural beauty olive oil so with keratin organic sorry with keratin organic olive oil 92% natural content, Cretan. So I'm going to go back over that with Cretan organic olive oil. That's 92% natural contact, content rather, <laughs> content. And that's olive oil shampoo for normal or dry hair. And it's for moisture and shine. Hydrates, nourishes with olive oil, botanical keratin and hyaluronic acid, sulfate free. So I knew very often straight away that sulfate free shampoos it's either something you're going to love or it's something you're going to hate because, of course, it's not got none of those artificial products in there, which makes the product really lather up. However, straight away I learned that when you're using this shampoo, use wet hair straight away. Very often, if I've sort of got just slightly damp hair, if I go into the bathroom, I've done my face, I've done my teeth in the morning, I then just sort of dampen my hair through, then I apply the shampoo, so some of my hair's still dry. With this, straight off, you do need to make sure that your hair's fully wet because it doesn't lather very... It do, where it doesn't have those artificial products in there, it doesn't go into that real full rich foam lather until your hair's wet then it does um, and really straight away what you'll notice is it's a really strong sometimes the only downfall to this sometimes a little overbearing and it's of sweets and it's almost like a really sweet scented sort of sugary smell it's lovely after a while of using it in your hair I do have to admit it is very rich and quite sickly and actually um, it really did start to sort of wear on me a little bit if I'm using this sort of every day. I don't use it every day, I have been using it every other day, kind of almost like um, like almost like a bit of a boost of health for my hair and scalp. Touching onto scalp, it really does look after your scalp, it's really quite nourishing on the scalp. I have to admit it's not a strong shampoo so if I've got a really slick or um, sort of back style or a side slick style with lots of hair gel I wouldn't be using this product to wash it all out because it's not sort of a real heavy shampoo to lift everything out or a real strong sort of cleansing. It's kind of really nourishing and looks after your hair. And that's why I consider that it does boost the shine of your hair and it certainly does enhance the moisture sort of, sort of in your hair as well. Let's just go into it a little bit more detail in the back here. So it's free of parabens, silicones, minerals, paraffin oil, allergens, filophilates, synthetic dyes, alcohol, Ethanol mine GMO and propylene glycero. So hopefully that's all pronounced right. Do excuse me if it's not. So it's free from all of those nasty products. Um, or at least those artificial products. So they're not all nasty. Of course, with some hair types, those products are great for creating slicker, sort of smoother hair, or for really, really smoothing out really quite frizzy hair. But in this shampoo, it's all about looking after hair and for the scalp and making the best possible quality of the hair you have. So here. Say goodbye to dry hair with our sulfate-free moisture-boosting shampoo. 
Hyaluronic acid and aloe vera retain the hair's moisture levels to keep it balanced. Organic olive oil and botanical keratin will strengthen and leave your hair with luminous shine. For improved results, you use with our Aphrodite Moisture Shine Conditioner. So that's what we're going to move on to in a moment. Really, really lovely product. So it's a 250 mils and I paid seven euros for this. So of course, even in euros, not too expensive really really nice product to use and you know you might think to yourself well if you're back in the uk why are you telling us all about this product because i've already checked you can buy this online it's a european based uh, website and it is in euros it's a little bit more expensive um but if you wanted to try it absolutely i'd say absolutely if you're looking for something which boosts shine and moisture and for that nice sort of overseas mediterranean feel that sort of we all love our holidays perhaps extend that sort of sensation of a holiday with the products you use. So really, really nice. Or if you're looking for that bit more of a Mediterranean gift, really lovely product to use. Um, seven euros. So a really good price. Really good price. Um, moving on to the conditioner. So again, they fit really, really well together. Packaging, they literally mirror each other. But this one is slightly smaller in size. So this is 200 mils. So the shampoo is 250 mils. The conditioner is 200. Here, let's talk about a little bit more. So the Aphrodite, the secret of natural beauty, olive oil. So with Critan organic 97.8 natural content olive oil. So the shampoo was 92% natural uh, natural content content rather, and the conditioner is 97.8. So here, for normal or dry hair conditioner, moisture and shine. Okay, with hyaluronic acid botanical keratin for softness and sheen, okay, and abyssinian oil, okay. So here, again, this one is silicon-free, okay. So here, free from parabens, silicons, polypylene, glycerine, or glycero, mineral paraffin oil, allergens, filophilates, synthetic dyes, alcohol, ethylamine, and GMO. Hopefully that's all pronounced right. And here we go. Reveal soft, lustrous hair with silicon-free moisture and shine conditioner. Organic olive, avocado, abyssinian oils nourish and soften the hair, whilst hyaluronic acid and botanical keratin deeply condition and hydrate. And you know what? They are really, really lightweight products. The conditioner after the shampoo, it's not heavy, it's not cakey on the hair. It doesn't really hold the hair down or anything like that at all. What it does do is it does leave the hair nice and fresh, nice and soft and healthy. Once you dry your hair off, whether you're going to be blow drying your hair through or you're leaving it natural, I can absolutely 100% agree it does make the hair soft, it does give you a lovely shine and it does really sort of increase that moisture in the hair, ready to give you that perfect canvas to go on and do that really nice style. Really lovely products and it really does give you that nice fresh feeling on your hair. It's got a real, for me it was a little overpowering in scent, that would be the only downfall of this product. The smell is a little bit too sickly. Lovely, lovely smell. It's a mixture of sort of like sweets, uh, sugar, and sort of really strong scented flowers. Um, would it be for masculine use? Yes, I believe it would. And for ladies as well. And of course, it's not sort of, it's not aiming in the packaging straight away at women. It's olive oil, which men do use as well. Um, and I would say it's a really lovely product to use. Would I buy it again? Now, through choice of smell, I probably wouldn't buy it again, but however, being on holiday, having that really lovely time, buying that nice sort of gift for somebody, it would certainly be something I would buy. Um, for me, because of the hair, and because of course you know from my channels by now, um, my, my videos rather on my channel, I use a lot of hair products. I have difficulty with the shampoo and conditioner washing all of the product out. If I'm using a texturizing powder, if I'm using a lot of a hairspray, I find it difficult. So what I tend to do, because I wash my hair in the evening, getting out all the hairspray, all the hair gel, what I've done for the day. First thing in the morning when I'm washing my hair through, I know it sounds crazy, but I wash my hair in the evening to get rid of all the product after the day. And in the morning to start a nice fresh canvas to do my hairstyle, I wash my hair in the morning as well. And with this, then I use it. Not all the time, every now and again. And it's a real nice sort of healthy kind of treat for your scalp. And it's really, really lovely. It goes on to make a really nice really nice sort of start for the day um, of you going into your hairstyle. Now, just touching on that, you may think why after I wash my hair at night and then in the morning. Well, as you all know, once you wash your face in the evening, throughout the night, your skin is busy working away, regenerating, your skin creates oils. So that's why we wash our face first thing in the morning. 
your scalp does exactly the same in my opinion and it's and it's it's an extension of your face so why would you not wash your face so i do my hair first thing in the morning and last thing at night as well so absolutely and i use a lot of products as well so it's quite nice to get that nice fresh feeling as well so with the aphrodite range i would absolutely recommend them will i buy them again I wouldn't because of choice of smell but however somebody might absolutely love that smell if somebody loves sort of sweet smelling things and that the sugary smell with sweet flowers it's an absolute must really really nice uh fragrance can men use it absolutely they can really nice fresh fragrance um and of course for long hair short hair uh if you've got problematic scalp it's got no nasty products in there at all so it'd be really quite nice and soothing if you've got quite an outbalanced scalp at the moment or you're having a problematic issue with sort of perhaps you've got a dry scalp it would be really really nice with the olive oil here it does increase moisture on the scalp and in the hair so absolutely if you wanted to give it a try it's all online literally i just typed in a search engine aphrodite olive oil shampoo and conditioner there's plenty of sites on there which offer it it's in euros so you may have to pay a little bit more for shipping but it's certainly something which i would absolutely recommend uh, so yes absolutely thank you very much for watching my clip today really very much enjoyed it and until next time we will see you then bye bye for now just quickly before you go i just remembered after i finished the clip i forgot to tell you the price of the conditioner so the shampoo the aphrodite shampoo that was seven euros the conditioner that was six euros fifty it's a little bit more expensive online but Give it a try if you want something from that kind of range, that kind of holiday feel, overseas, really, really lovely product to use. Of course, personally for me, everybody's different. I didn't necessarily go too much on the smell, but the actual quality of the products themselves, really, really good. So if you're looking for that little bit more of health, moisture, shine, there's another product to use. Okay, thanks very much for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.